Hey guys and welcome back. My name is O'Hapel and today we've got a great Titanfall gameplay for you. We are going to be giving you first day tips. What you can do right out the gate to just make yourself pick up the game a lot faster, have a lot more fun. And look at this Titan double kill. One Titan down. And let's doom the other one right here. Beauty, beauty, beauty. This game is flawless. I think you'll enjoy it, so stick around. Alright, so like I mentioned, this game is flawless, um, but kind of. Like, I get one death right as the match, right as we win the match, and that doesn't count on the scoreboard. So I do die, but the scoreboard still shows me flawless, so that's kind of interesting. It is a pretty good game. We have some fun. Look at this wall running, too. Jeez. We're just going off real hard at the beginning. And the first tip I want to give you guys is switch your settings over to Bumper Jumper. Do it right now. Do it on day one. If you switch your controls to Bumper Jumper, it's just going to make it a lot easier for you to free run around the map, do stuff like you just saw me do there. What it does is it's essentially switching your A button and your left bumper. And all that is is switching your ability, which is cloak or stim, um, or when you have your titan out, your shield or smoke. Um, it's swatch swapping that for your jump. And jumping in this game is a lot more important, or boosting if you're in your titan, is a lot more important than those special abilities. So switch it to bumper jumper, and that way you'll get used to it right from day one. I think you guys will, you'll probably have a hard time switching over, but as soon as you do it and get used to it, it will benefit your game. Again, talking control schemes, tinker around with the sensitivity. This doesn't have quite as fine of sensitivity controls as Call of Duty does, where you have like a 1 through 20. This just has like, I don't know, five or six different settings. Find the one that's right for you and get used to it, because really what it is, it's not about which control is best, it's about which one is best for you. So find it, get used to it, and once you're used to it, you'll have a lot easier time of it. Get off my Titan. Who do you think you are? Next up, we're going to be talking about where to join in. Play the campaign. Play it on Militia side, play it on IMC side. This will unlock both of the other Titans for your creative class. And it's kind of fun. It brings you through the same maps and the same game modes twice from both sides. And it kind of gives some narrative for the game overall. So that way when you're playing on those maps in, in multiplayer generally, you'll have a lot more fun because you'll kind of understand the context of what that battle is. And the campaign is not, it's not like it's anything super different from the regular multiplayer. The campaign is just like, here's a multiplayer match, and here's some kind of like cinematic cutscenes and audio with it. And that makes it so that you can just add some context to it. It's not too bad. On to your first day class loadout. That carbine is your best friend. When you're starting out, that is one of the best weapons you can use. It's great at close range, it's great at long range. It's just a great gun overall. You can unlock some great attachments for it pretty quickly. So make sure to use that carbine and just use that carbine pretty much for your first five or ten levels and you will have a very easy time of it. It's one of the best guns in the game. For the Titans, with the default classes, it can be really tempting to go to that Strider or go to that Ogre. Personally, what I've seen is that the Ogre and the Atlas are the best. The Strider, I don't know what it is. Theoretically, the speed should be able to account for it. Maybe I'm just not a skilled enough pilot. But whenever I hop in that Strider, it's just over. You're done every single time very quickly. If you're in that Ogre and you use your Shield Core or in your Atlas and you use your Damage Core, you can really end up going ham on these guys. It makes it great. Look at me go off on these guys as they try to get extracted, using those grenades to try to block the routes and identify them a little bit easier, get those hit markers, pick them off, get a couple kills here. It's pretty fun. Anyways, that's about all the tips I have for you. Use the Atlas or the Ogre, use that Carbine, switch it to Bumper Jumper, That'll get you off on the right foot. We got a lot more tips coming for you guys on this channel, so make sure to subscribe if you're not already. We released a cool montage earlier today, so check that out. And we will be streaming later tonight at 6 p.m. Mountain Time. We're going to be talking about clans in Titanfall. Clans in Titanfall are not like you might be used to in Call of Duty, but there is a way to do it still, so I'm going to be talking about that. Anyways, guys, like, favorite, and subscribe. I hope you guys are all having a great day with Titanfall. Take it easy.